very good afternoon and welcome to the Silich International Cricket Stadium. We're all set for semi-final number two of the Women's Asia Cup. And this is between Pakistan and Sri Lanka. Right, the news from the centre is Sri Lanka. They won the toss and they will be batting first. Pakistan will probably be favourites. But if Sri Lanka get off to a flying start like they did in the game between the two sides, it's going to be game on. Well, someone who's got them to give them that start is Anushka, of course, Sanjivani. And uh, she's partnered in the middle by the skipper, Chamre Atapattu. And it's going to be the left hand, uh, Sadia Igbal, 10 wickets in her T20 international career. Bam! But it's just going to hold up. This, the struggle, the straight pull, quick run taken, but safe enough. Big one, gone the distance. Brilliant. The skipper was trying to do that for a while now. This time she latched on. Goes again. This time it hangs in there. As we speak, she just went across the line. I thought she'd be a little more sensible. She seems to be sedate enough, but this was the wrong one. Line of the ball to choose and completely cleaned up. Atapatu is cleaned up for 10. It's 23 for 1. Hoshida Samarukrama, 32nd match for her. Goes big. How far is that going? Just, just falling there. I think that that was wise on the part of the fielder to try and save the boundary rather than try and take it out. But look at this brilliant body on the line, two run save for the team. Full toss, put it away. That is easy picking. Thank you very much. Lose delivery. I'm going to blast it away to the boundary. Fully bold. I think she was uh, taking too many chances, Anushka. She was sweeping off the stumps. That time it was a nothing shot. Out for 26. It's 39 for 2. Nilakshi De Silva. She has a fair bit of experience. Good strike rate. Well bold. Well bold. A bit of bounce. Certainly did the batter. 47 for 2. Well, that's the one I was talking about and she's uh, hit that quite nicely because it's gone a lot finer. Sooner than later they need some big shots just like that and a good attempt. This is committed fielding in the deep. Had to cover a lot of ground and showed that uh, saved a couple of runs. Yes. The 50 partnership is done. It's a vital time to lose a wicket going into the last five overs. Nilakshi is someone who can really hit the long ball out for 14. She took her time. 89 for 3. All right, Hasini Pereira coming in. Strike rate is 72. They're asking for a catch. They're asking for a catch. Give up. That was out. She struck in every over she's bowled. She's got important wickets. Not too many runs in the bar, but Harshida did the damage with the bat. 35 of 41, 102 for 4. Those are the runners seeing another left-hander. This is good because Sri Lanka understands that uh, the remaining bowlers would be spinning it into the left-hander. Four. That's four. That's very well played by Hassini. She's walking around and fired in. Hassini had to play shots like that. Out for 13, it's 112 for 5. Right, Kavisha Dilhari is the new batter. Swung away on the leg side. That's a welcome boundary. That is a welcome boundary for Sri Lanka at this stage. It's a wide, stumped off a wide, has to be a wide, not been called. 
Look at this. Oh, why wasn't it called a wide? I don't know. Should have been called a wide. Oh, the head umpire deciding otherwise. Sri Lanka finish on a very competitive 122 for six. The best betting performance. If you take away that Thailand game, this is the Sri Lankan batting consistent. Atapatu out for 10, but then that those partnerships, everyone getting a start. Anushka and Harshita really getting some runs at the top and useful runs at the bottom too, towards the end or in the middle. Sri Lanka getting 122 for 6. Pakistan will need a little better than a runner ball. 123 of 120 balls. The two batters who will need to get off to a flyer will be Sidra Amin. She's partnered there in the middle for Pakistan by Muniba Ali, who's been a sort of a middling performance in uh, this uh, Women's Asia Cup. First ball of the Pakistan innings from round the wicket. Ball short and wide. You spoke of discipline, that's indiscipline. In fact, she doesn't go over mid on, she goes square and he gets a boundary. This is really a very ordinary bowler. Ordinary over, I must say, I beg your pardon. An ordinary ball. Nicely looped. Good fielding. Good fielding. That's the, now they're asking for they're asking for the run out. I think the Sri Lankans think they've got it. Well, the umpire signal to the physio, I think. Has she gone upstairs that uh, now? I think Muniba is in trouble. Muniba is definitely in trouble. This will be very, very unfortunate if uh, she has some kind of a tweak. I think they have gone upstairs. Quick pick up and throw. She fell short, lost her bat. And I think she's going to be out. Oh my goodness. Very unfortunate way of getting out. And uh, the three dreaded letters, O-U-T. Only by his run out for 18 of 10 balls. It's 31 for one. Straight away. That tells you that she is in very good form. Look at the way she saw it and the timing. Reverse straight into the hands, the pressure, building and in the end, it's Sidra Ami who has hit that straight to the fielder at short third. Big wicket, wicket that was needed. He's dismissed Sidra Ami for nine, it's 47 for two. Omaima Suhail is the new batter. A nice looking shot. Expensive over, eight runs in that over, 55 for two. <laughs> to the two the time, oh, this is very close. Look at Kavisha Dilhari. She is pumped up. She's the one who affected the run out. And now she's got a wicket with the ball to go with this. She has to go. Mama Soil gone for 10. 65 for three. Come with the air, come with the woman, need a dar to the crease. Swept away. I was just about to tell you it had been 45 deliveries since the last boundary. Single to close out. The over six runs come off it. 84 for three. Well, that's the boundary they're looking for. That's the break free shot. Another run. Just dropping and running. They might look for two. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Only a single. Only a single. <laughs> Possibilities of a second if they wanted to. And the over five of it. It's 105 for three. <laughs> what was she trying to do? She was just trying to maneuver it. Sri Lanka have got an important wicket. Bismarck goes for 42. 
Pakistan, one of seven for four. Elisha Nazim. Very high. Can this be taken? It has been taken. Nazim strikes. Her intentions were very, very clear. Beg your pardon, Inoka strikes. Nazim the batter out. Aisha Nazim goes for two. Pakistan 1-1-0 one, one, for five. Okay. Another big striker, Riaz, Alia Riaz, striking at uh, over 91. <laughs> they are for a catch. They are very confident. The umpire doesn't think so. It's a dot ball, but a precious dot ball. Which means Pakistan still need nine of the last over. Ball. Oh, lucky, really lucky a single, but that is cleverly bowled. Good Yorker. Followed the batter. She'll have to hold her nerve. She'll have to hold her nerve. Oh, precious dot, precious dot. Oh, my goodness. The wicket keeper misses it too. She had all three stumps to aim at, and how did you miss it? What a semi final. Who's going to win it? Is it going to be Sri Lanka? Is it going to be Pakistan? Well, the last ball will tell you. Three of one. Goes over the top. Oh, drops it, drops it, drops it. Now they're coming back for two, coming back for two. Gone! Sri Lanka has won. What do you think of it? Sri Lanka has won by one run. An amazing performance by the Sri Lankans. They're going to the final. Pakistan was so close, but eventually just a little bit too far. Told you, Roshan, told you. It ain't over until it's over. Hello, have a look at that reaction. I know how it feels. They'll be hugely disappointed. They cannot believe it. But Sri Lanka, you got to give it to Sri Lanka. That is an incredible performance to ensure that in the end, they go on and win by just a single run. Unbelievable. Sri Lanka move into the final. Sri Lanka win by one run and they get into the final of an Asia Cup after 14 years. They uh, held their nerve and restricted Pakistan to 121 for six after Sri Lanka made 122 for six.